In Jeremiah chapter 29, verse 11, the Bible tells us, For I know the plans that I have for you. They are plans to prosper you and not to harm you, to give you a future and to give you a hope. And what I want to show you out of this scripture is, number one, that it's God's plan of seeing and making sure that his children are consistently walking in victory all the days of their life. And God made that possible, how? By seating us together in heavenly places with Christ Jesus, which guarantees us the victory every time. And by also coming to live on the inside of us through the power of the Holy Spirit. Listen, as children of God, we couldn't have been better positioned than to be seated in heavenly places with Christ. Because the moment we were seated at the table with Christ, every power and work of darkness came under our feet. By God placing you with Christ in heavenly places, he has positioned you to have guaranteed victory, meaning that there is no other outcome other than victory for the child of God who takes his seat at the table. Listen, losing is not an option for you. Losing is not an option when you have been placed and given all things by Christ to win the battles of life. You know, I've heard people say nothing in life is guaranteed. But if the Bible is true in what it teaches and you live by the word and walk according to the instruction of the Lord. Listen, life will not be difficult for you, but life will become sweeter and sweeter with every passing day because God's instructions were never given to us to make life hard and to make life difficult. But God's word was given to us to make life very, very easy. You know, Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 1 says, If you fully obey the Lord your God and carefully keep all his commands that I am giving you today, the Lord your God will set you high above all the nations of the world. And in verse 8, it also says that the Lord will guarantee a blessing on everything you do and will fill your storehouses with, with grain. Now, according to God's word, you can have guaranteed blessing by your obedience to God's instruction. Listen, God has had a plan for us to consistently have victory, joy, peace, and a full supply. How? By simply walking in obedience to his word. Everything you experience, my friend, is directly connected to your obedience or your disobedience. With disobedience, the Bible teaches us that the curse always prevails, but with obedience, the blessing will prevail in your life. And today, my friend, you decide, not anyone else, but you decide what you experience in life or what your experience in life would be. And I hope you choose right because Deuteronomy chapter 28 verse 1 says, if you fully obey the Lord your God and carefully keep all his commands that I am giving you today, the Lord your God will set you high above all the nations of the world. You know, people ask me all the time, why would I serve God? And I respond by asking them a question. Why wouldn't you want to serve God when he has nothing but blessings and good to pour out on those who will walk in full obedience to his word? Today, God has made it possible through Jesus for you to take your seat at the table and to walk in power, dominion, and victory if you will only walk in obedience to the Word of God.